Hello guys, this is Adam, welcome to the Adam Lab and this is a twin motion and the version that we are looking at is 2022.2 and that is the preview version which is the new one and we are testing that on the 16 inch MacBook Pro with 64 gigabyte of RAM, 8 terabyte of SSD with 32 core uh, GPU and then 10 core CPU so it's the fully maxed out version and right now we have the material room and everything is set to the max to the ultra and the average frame rate that we are getting is around 80 frames per second and again we have everything on ultra and the average that we are getting is 80 frames the gpu is being used almost to the max at 92 as you can see right here and then the CPU is literally chilling and we are at 24 at 25 percent but it's really stable at 24 and then when it comes to the file loading time it's a 20 seconds so let's just go ahead and move a little bit inside and then see how that would look like we are moving inside right now we are still averaging in the 70s to the 80s so i would still your average probably would be 75 which is actually very similar to unreal engine 5 test which if you have watched the previous video then you know unreal engine 5 was being tested and it was a very similar results as well and again that's the material room now not a lot of people work on their project with ultra usually you would find them work on high or medium and when it comes to ultra they want to re preview it to the customer so let's say you have this and you want to view it to the customer you will be doing the ultra and then everything is being shown no problems at all let's look at the statistics when it comes to the cpu the cpu is chilling the cores are not being used to the complete max but the gpu is definitely being used to the max thing i want to know and C is the RAM usage. As we have 64 gigabyte of RAM, we are only using 15 gigabyte of RAM out of the whole 60. And that is a great. So even if you have 16 gigabyte of RAM, you can still work with it. However, I do not recommend getting 16 gigabyte of RAM. I would definitely say at least get the 32 um, gigabyte of RAM with your M1 Max and you will be good to go. Now what we will do, we will go to the settings right here. We will go to preferences. From preferences, we've got quality. As you can see, everything is set to ultra so what we will change we will change to high and then click ok all of a sudden now we are averaging 120 frames for the cpu the cpu just jumped a little bit i believe because i was moving around doing the settings all of that so the cpu jumped to 35 percent usage but that is still fine and then the gpu is still being used almost at the max and we are averaging 120 frames so let's go ahead and move and holy bananas this is a smooth because this is the promotion display which means it can go up to 120 frames probably you would not see it um since this video mostly is in 30 frames but in general what i am seeing right now is a very smooth movement um since this monitor is 120 frames and what we are averaging is around 113 to 118 while i am moving but in general the average that we have is around 120 frames now what we will do we will go to preferences again and then we will go to the quality that most people work with when they are working on a project and that would be medium and for the medium we're looking at 264 frames the cpu usage definitely jumped very high to 72 percent and what we are looking at uh, gpu wise is around 86 percent so actually the gpu usage right now is going down instead of it being really high but in general we are averaging 260 frames and trust me that's more than enough to work because usually you need 120 or 60 but holy bananas this is a freaking fast because right now the frame rate is double my monitor frame rate so everything is like double the speed so we are averaging above 
200 frames at all times and usually people when they work they work with medium so if you are working on medium with the m1 max with 32 core gpu and then you have 32 gigabyte of ram you will be good to go now for the fun of it i know not a lot of people use low but some people do if they have let's say weak uh, computers or whatever that might be we're actually holy bananas on low we are averaging right now 333 frames per second. This is insane. The GPU usage is very low. This is what you will be looking at. So your average with the low is probably around 300 frames or 290 frames. What I would recommend is that you would just go to normal and then go from there. Now, the last thing I want to test is just to put it on auto and see what is the recommended point of work that the software thinks you should be working with. So the software we should be think that we should be working with with everything on high and that makes sense because on high we are getting around 122 frames per second so it makes sense for the software to put everything on high with that we are averaging right now 100 frames while we are moving the cpu only at 34 percent and then the gpu is at 97 percent and i believe that is the sweet spot that twin motion believe this is the good thing now with all of the testing that we did we are getting the okay check mark which means everything is good and we are all good to go and then with everything it's a 20 seconds file loading time now this is for the material room i will definitely be testing i believe it called the lockheart lake or something like that in a different video so if you want to see that just hit subscribe if there's any testing that you want it to be done hit it in the description you know what to do comments all of that fun stuff aside from that this was adam Thank you for joining me in the Adam Lab and happy 4th of July. I will see you very soon. Bye-bye.